I guess I'll warm up with a few Blitz games. Isn't this, wait a minute, isn't this Holy Rose's brother? It is. I'm playing Ali Rose's brother. I played the French against Ali Rose's brother. Hopefully he goes here. And then here. This? How loud are his shoes? I don't know. I don't know. I heard Ali Reza stream today and he was in a good mood though, so that's important. You know what I wonder? Is Ali Reza with his brother right now? Because I didn't see his brother in um, Toronto. Only saw his dad. Who do I think is going to win the candidates? You know, if I had to make a prediction, like right now, you said, who do you think is going to win? I would say it's probably going to be Nepo, Gukesh, Prague, Fabiano, Hikaru, or Vidit. Like, I would imagine it's going to be one of those six. He's going to show you the Blitzstream way of kicking asses. Um, You know, I'm not going to lie. I really... I. I used to get annoyed when Blitzstream fans would be in this chat. But then I realized they all just live like a really sad life. You know? And, you know, now I just sort of treat them like... You know, how do I say this nicely? I, I kind of treat them like if I saw a kid begging for money on the street, you know, I would feel... I would feel really like sad for them and and I might try to help them out. That's sort of how I feel. Emote only mode right now? Why would I do emote only mode? I don't like why do you why should I do that? Why should I do emote only mode? Hans joined. Yes, yes, yes. I know. I know. I saw that. I saw that Hans joined them. Uh it was good. It was good. Um the collab between them. Um, you know, I can, I'm going to just say this. I, I've been really enjoying the entertainment that Hans Niemann is bringing to the chess world. And I do specifically say entertainment because he, he's so clearly playing a heel, you know, Hans, like Hans is trying to be like the Colby Covington a little bit. And I just find it very fun and, and funny. Like he talks so much trash and then out of nowhere, he's so nice. Like Hans will go on the chess base India stream and be like, Sagar, like everything you're doing for chess is fantastic. And then he'll be like, you know, I watch Gotham and I lose rating. And then he'll be like, yo Gotham, like, you know, you're, uh, I, I, I don't know. It's uh, it, he, he's doing, he's doing some very interesting and exciting things. Uh, and uh, I I feel as though Hans is a bit misunderstood, you know? Let's go here. I guess he can castle, which I forgot about. I'm up a piece. I don't know how that happened. Against Ali Reza's brother, which is probably not a good thing, because if I win, he'll he'll call his younger sibling. Generally, you go and you call your older sibling, but in chess, you call your younger sibling. <laughs> You're just like, yo... Come help me beat this idiot. Uh, I also discounted Holloway. I mean, I didn't discount him. I just thought that Justin... Well, you know, I will say this. Like, Max won the fight, and it was an epic fight. But if he doesn't break Justin Gaethje's nose, that fight could go very differently. And I understand that's a massive if, but he broke his nose. So, we'll never really know. And I, I don't think that's a crazy thing to say. He broke his nose. Like, Gaethje did not fight like Justin Gaethje because he had a broken nose. And that's life. But uh, the Chandler announcement, that's not really exciting to me because we knew that was going to happen forever, you know? Also, he poked his nose. Yeah, also he poked him in the eye twice, which I love Max Holloway, but like, come on. All 
All right, let's play one more game. Let's go C4. I'm excited to see Drickus fight. I'm excited to see him uh, go against uh, Adesanya. And we'll see what happens. I'm going to go Knight C2 because I think this setup is really strange. I don't know why Mr. Mohamed Reza is letting me do all of this. H6. Going to try to play a little bit faster today, a little bit more aggressively. Put the knight there. I guess he can castle and then just put the knight, uh, the bishop back on the h8 square. But I like my knights. I like this. And surprised Fide doesn't accommodate Sagar. What do you mean? Doesn't accommodate. They've been they've been quite accommodating. I think Fide gets a bad reputation, <laughs> rightfully so, for some of their decision making. But um, I think they've done a pretty good job. This candidates. I don't know. I don't have anything. Um... Did you guys see my interview with the uh, CEO of Fide? Emil Sutovsky, we debated the future of chess. It's a nice idea. He's giving me this because I can't take it, so he's not really giving it to me. Um, I'm going to take on f5. Who's the best player in candidate? I don't know, dude. I, like, I don't, I don't know what you want me to say. They're all good. The margin between them is microscopic. Kind of like your rating. Who do I think can beat Nepo in the candidates? <laughs> Apparently nobody. What do you want me to say? Apparently nobody. Um... No, it doesn't work. Still. Oh, I'm in trouble. I am in trouble. Am I in trouble? Wait a minute. What is going on? Hold on. <laughs> Please go here. This is nuts. Okay, I have knight c6, and I win my queen back. What the f***? <laughs> this is insane. And he's still hanging here. But I guess at the end of it, I'm down in exchange. Crazy. That was really weird. I mean, I'm for sure still losing, but... At least that was exciting. I thought maybe he would hang that. I thought maybe he didn't know how the pieces moved. I actually don't hate my position. <laughs> He's winning, sure, but um, could be worse. Knight g4. I'm just being annoying. Everything is pretty well protected. I'm just going to walk up the board. Will I walk up the board? What if I play knight f6? I'm 
I'm having a blast. This is very exciting. Okay, let's not get mated. That's a good move. Discover check. Clean. Nice little two zip. Oh, he's fast. But, oh, he doesn't have a title. Why does he not have a title? I can't play him again. I'm not running away. I have to play title Tuesday. 